Hello, my darlings. Just wanted to share with you what I do with my hair since this quarantine happened. I'm in my bathroom yet again because I have two mirrors here, so it makes it easier to do my hair. I thought it would be a perfect time to do some protective styling where I could just set it and forget it for a few days. What I like about this is that it takes 10 minutes tops and I can sleep on it and stays pretty neat and my hair has been so moisturized that I am I'm just singing right now because I don't have that brittleness when I leave my hair in a afro for too long. So let me show you what I do. Here's what my look is now. I had this in for about four days already, so I just want to like tighten it up. So I'm just going to start by taking these out. I'm just going to need some water and my favorite leave-in. When I first put these in after I washed my hair, I did add some Eco Styler and some Edge Control, but I haven't added that since I washed my hair, which is, I washed my hair over a week ago. So what I like about this style too is it gives me really nice stretch. So even if you want to do this just to stretch your hair overnight for whatever other style you want to do, I think it's great. I like to do a little curve just so it's not so boring. And then I'm going to bring that curve to the back. And I'm going to split it down the middle. Okay, so I had to put my glasses on. See what I was doing. But here's my part. And I'm going to stick with that and I'm going to kind of tuck this away. Now I have my water bottle. I got this off of Amazon for like six or seven dollars and I love it. I find that a finer mist penetrates my hair more than just a regular spray bottle. This has changed my life, actually. Even the moisture all around. Oh yeah. Oh yes. It's a great investment. They really have to like wait a second for the water to actually get in there. Because it sits on top. Yeah, but it's still dry. I don't want it wet because I like the stretch that I have and it's going to make it easier for me to work with. It already has a lot of conditioner, so I think I'm just gonna use water. Get the brush. And when it's in the braid, sometimes I just spray it with water and conditioner on top, my leave-in conditioner, just spray it on top of the braids and kind of massage it with my fingers. And it's fine, it doesn't undo my style. And I can always make sure that my hair's not dry. I'm not a great braider. I don't even know why. I try. You know what? I try because you get better each time. So I find that braiding holds more than doing this with a two strand twist. With a twist, it's not going to last for more than one or two nights. A braid can last all week. Wearing it like this, I'm not washing it as much because it's not bothering me. It's not getting dirty because it's back and it's so moist that I don't want to lose that when I wash it because I figure like when I used to do box braids, I wouldn't wash my hair for a whole month and I get growth and it's fine. So you really have to go what works for you. Because the whole point of a protective style is that you really leave your hair alone, leave your hair alone. So I'm really just gonna start grabbing pieces. Try to do pieces that are approximately the same size each time when I grab. That's one side done. I'm not gonna braid to the tips because I'm actually gonna braid the two sides together so that they connect and it stays neat and tidy and I don't have to use bobby pins. But yeah, I'm not too mad at that. I mean, it's a little loose here. I told you I'm not the best at braiding, but that's gonna hold. It's not gonna go anywhere. Some water. Treat it like a plant. Like this is a plant we want to nurture. We want it to flourish. I really only detangle it when I on wash day. Okay, 
other side. Split this to three. So I have one, two, three. I'm going to braid the two sides together. I'm just going to give it a twirl. I don't like to go all the way to the end because I don't want it to knot. But we're going to turn that around like doing a band tube and just tuck it in. And that's going to stay. So tell me what you have been doing during your isolation to keep your hair in healthy working order. I don't feel like I'm just ready for bed, that I'm actually being productive throughout the day. I did my hair. My hair is done. Put a little blush on and we're good to go. If you want to see more videos from me, I'd love to see you again, darling. Take care.